Welcome. Welcome to webinar. Today we're going to be showing you how to flip houses from the convenience of your home. Have you noticed this first slide saying home buyers pays only $1,600 for a piece of property worth $370,000? By the way, this is a newspaper Vancouver's son and the lovely lady named Bethany Lancy was reporting it on June 25th. Now, question. Why so low price? How come nobody shows up? That's the niche market. So today we're going to be showing you in this webinar how to buy properties. We're going to be disclosing the address of the properties and show you how you can make a lot of money by flipping houses and those properties you may have never seen before. Well, here is the scenario. Who am I? My name is Navtaj. I've been doing it for past 25 years plus. I have been commended by RCMP pertaining to drop houses and meth labs. I've been uh, a, I have one of the largest Canadian real estate investor group. I teach in the courts, by the way. I'm from the old school. I believe in not learning by reading books. I like to learn by doing things or watching things in real time and so on. I have been very fortunate to work with Kevin O'Leary. I shared a stage with them and I had done about about 500,000 Canadians, I've taught them for the last 25 years though. So these are simple few pictures of the dragons I'm with, pretty casual. They do the same thing what I do and the principle remain the same though. Uh, this is a couple of pictures, how we do is when we go in the field, in, if you notice in the middle, we have John Tory, the mayor of Toronto, we have registry office, uh, some pictures from the builders and builders and developers from Montreal, to other people in the bus to uh, Supreme Court of Alberta. Uh, disclaimer, information strategies and opinion expressed are only for general information. Please make sure you verify information with the, the, with the professionals. In case you're getting legal advice, make sure it's only and only in writing. So regardless when we buy a house, we're gonna sell, whether we hold it for one day or, or 20 years, Eventually, we need to sell it, and the uh, and the car on, on the purpose buy low, sell high applies no matter what. For me, I don't have the patience, neither I have the time, so I like to make profit today, and today is a good day to make money. And I'm gonna show you how to do it as we go along. Though, question: How do you do that? Number one, how to find these deep discounted properties. Number two, how to evaluate them quickly. Third thing: How do you secure them without putting any money? And number four is assign them, flip them, or some people will do fix and flip them. Again, when you're fixing and flipping it, or rehabbing it, it costs a lot more money. But uh, my purpose of this webinar is to show you do it without any money, without looking at the property, doing most of the work from the convenience of your home and courtesy of your internet or, or your cell phone or your computer. Now, question, what kind of people who will come to you, why would they come to you? Well, we have simple ads, so we buy houses for all cash written off within 48 hours who ask closing. Now, what does that mean? These are not regular people who need to sell their home at a fair market value. Due to their circumstances, what are the reasons are, they're facing foreclosure, or power of sale, or the circumstances have, have, have came up that they need to get rid of the house. It's no different than people go to pawn shop and they take a ten thousand worth of a engagement ring, and they're happy to get a five hundred dollar cash instantly. Why? Because cash is the king, and cash is the necessity. So same scenario applies in real estate as well, though. But again, I must stress: we do not steal houses from the old lady with a cancer. We don't do that. We help the old ladies. Now it's the same scenario. What happened in Vancouver? Somebody bought a piece of property. The fact that there was nobody else bidding on it, the highest bid they received for a property worth $370,000 was $1,600 approximately. And that's the good part of it. It means your competition is what? Dead. Try to buy a house from a builder from $370,000. You're going to see a lineup for three days. People are a big deposit, not even a single cent discount. Why bother going there where all the herd are going? 
go to places where you are the only and sole per only sole per person who buying the property at a humongous discount. As a matter of fact, nobody's gonna believe it, including your mother, your wife, or your kid. They're gonna say this is not true. But again, we're gonna show you how to do it. Uh, one more thing, we're gonna be giving you a special gift for attending this webinar: assistance for lower income homeowners, as well as grants for first-time home buyers. How this money comes along, and how do you get to keep all the money for yourself? By the way, this is our taxpayers' money. This come, this money come from provincial, federal, municipal, crown corporation, charities, and foundations as well. At the end of it, I'm going to show you how we're going to send you a list of top 10 real estate grants available for you. Uh, we also have a book, by the way, called Forgive Your Canadian Real Estate Grants. You can get this book as i shown to you. It'll show you exactly how to get a free down payment assistance, home repair program, emergency repair program, tax credit and rebates, and a lot of information about energy saving plans, though. So this is a couple of properties that recently got sold in Kelowna as well as in Toronto. These properties are sold at auction. When you want to buy a piece of property in auction, keep in mind the chances are you are paying approximately 25 cents or maximum 50 cents a dollar. You can Google it as much as you like. Every time a piece of property gets sold on auction will be sold at somewhere from 25 to 75 percent discount. Now, there's another piece of property in Sydney, Nova Scotia. There was a development which was in trouble and it got auctioned off for $26,000. By the way, the sources from the Cape Breton Post in the newspaper, and you can see it. And if you have a question, please feel free to call Nancy King from Cape Breton Post. Say, hey, you have a, a newspaper and you're saying the $300 million development got sold for $26,000. Is that a fact? The best thing is to verify directly with the source, though. Now, we have a very special training program coming up for you. This training program could be up to five hours of pure, real, high-value education. And the only cost is only $50 plus taxes. If you need to get a ticket, it's go to flippingforprofit.ca. It's five hour. We're going to give you proper uh, a manual to follow that as well, though. So here is a piece of property which was abandoned by due to fire. And our student picked up this property in Welland. They, they picked it up for $76,000. After repairing it, they sold it for two eighty four. dollars If you look at it, they made about a gross profit of $208,000. But that's not the net profit. Again, this property was abandoned for four years. Again, what can you buy for $76,000 detached house, brick house, in valid? Again, there are pl plenty of opportunities. We're going to show you how these deals come to us. We do not find them. They find us. Uh, there's another piece of property uh, we acquired two years ago. It was in Beaverton. And the current owner paid for $140,000 for it, and they had it for a couple of years. And then again, they lost interest. The property needed some repair. They called us and they said, we need to get rid of it. We bought it for $66,000. After fixing it slightly, not much of it, but $30,000 worth of repair to upgrade it to a really, really high end and furnish it. Now, this is property is being rented out for about $125, $175 a day plus $50 charges for cleanup on daily basis. This m property is money-making machine. On top of that, the good thing is, the property value is worth about $245,000. So this is a typical property. We pick it up from tired landlords, though. Another piece of property, the same scenario, this property was in Tweed, and this gentleman was to a point where he had, the property needed a bit of a repair, not much of it, but he was in a bit panic situation. We picked it up, we sold it, and the profit was about $115,000. It's in the same scenario, uh, it was a very motivated seller, got into some trouble financially, need to get it out. We picked up the property for hundred sixty. dollars After fixing slightly, you know, just like lipstick and powder type of thing, very minimum, and our student sold it for $252,000. Uh, this is another interesting one. In Ontario, we have a lot of property come in, which we call tax lien or tax sale properties. So this property was approximately worth, in my opinion, $200,000. Our student picked it up for $8,008. ,008. 
It's an amazing, amazing deal, by the way, and we'll show you how to do these type of deals all day long. Uh, there's another interesting property in uh, in Vancouver. Those who are familiar with it, there's a small town called Abbotford, and this person who was the owner of the property was a bit of a holder, and they have too much junk and too much garbage in the house, so shouldn't pick it up and flip it instantly, and there was a huge profit that they made. Uh, another scenario I'd like to show you, which we call, is a quick assignment, quick flip. All we do is put a piece of property under a contract, put an initial investment of $10 deposit. He assigns simply the contract to somebody else for getting cool 20000 bucks. That happens right here in Kelowna, where the majority of people think Kelowna is very rich. Perhaps nobody goes broke. Trust me, it happens everywhere all across Canada. So again, we have training coming up, and we want you to go up quickly, grab your ticket. It's five hours for your training. We're going to show you for five hours pure education, high value, Canadian. And the people who are going to share it with you are Canadian experts. And they'll share with you how to buy and flip these properties, though. Next thing I like to talk about is stigmatized properties. These properties, a lot of people do not realize it. When people talk about, you know, buying end up in lemon or lemonade, this property, one has to be very careful. Some of these property have issues with structure, it will have stigma, it has some sort of a uh, haunted house and so on. So these are something we will talk more about it when you kind of come in for five hour training. Just to let you know, here's what the city of Toronto sold. In October 28, 2010, according to the newspaper Toronto Sun, the city of Toronto sold five properties worth $8.6 million for $395,000 altogether. Now again, one more time, property value $8.6 million sold by the city of Toronto for the total price of $395,000. This is a story when you buy haunted houses though. Again, one more thing people, want to, people have misconception about foreclosures and power of sales. Those two issues, we are in Canada. Every piece of property which is under power of sale or foreclosure must be sold at fair market value. In Canada, the banks are not allowed to own real estate. Again, this is a very different ball game altogether. Most of Canadians have misconception about power of sale or foreclosure properties. I'm gonna be showing with you how to buy these properties before they become we call pre-foreclosure or pre-power sale as well. We have five hours of pure education for you. And all going to cost you is $50, by the way. This is another piece of property where the gentleman needed to redeem the property. It was sold on power sale. How he was able to redeem the property at the last minute, even though he got kicked out of the property, they changed the locks. They took the possession of the property. They had a property management. They sold a piece of property on MLS, and a few days before the property did close, he was able to take this property back, and we were able to make a good profit and able to save his scenario at the same time. There's another piece of property where we had issue with the pre-power sale, where the lender was going to charge a ridiculous amount of money because of being a B or C lender, their fees are so huge. So we end up picking up this property and perhaps made a reasonably good profit on this deal as well though. Uh, one more thing, people do not realize it. A lot of properties in Canada got seized by different, different departments. One of the key departments is CRA, your line of credit, your credit card companies, and some kind of judgments and so on. So these properties got sold in auction all across Canada. So you're going to be learning a lot more about it when you're going to come in for five hour training, which we call crash course, by the way. So what to do is very simple. Here's this lovely lady. She got about a million dollar in government grants. It was uh, in the Global Mail. By the way, just verify this information and just check it out. Google it and see, does it really happen? So again, we are inviting all of you to come and attend a five hour program for $50 only. Get your ticket right now. We'll show you how to buy these properties 30 to 85% below market value. And you're able to flip them where you don't need any money or any cash. Uh, well, I'm looking forward to seeing you all. Thank you very much.